So today I'm going to be teaching you, guys, teaching you guys how to play Repeat Until Death by Nogo Amor. I think that's how you say it. It's a really, really easy song to play. There's only four chords for the entire thing. So it's going to be a quick video. Let's go. So first thing you need to know is that you need a capo. Also, there's paint on my guitar. I'm going to ignore that. Yeah, you need a capo, first fret. I'm going to put the capo on the first fret. I'm going to tune my guitar first. Make sure your guitar is tuned. If you don't know how to tune your guitar, you can just download an app. Um, guitar tuner you can find them in the app store so capo first fret my guitar is dirty and just pay on it we're gonna ignore all that yeah it's better better lighting kind of i guess yeah so four chords first chord is a c then g a minor and f so if you know how to play those you can just skip i'm gonna teach you guys how to play them real quick if you don't okay so for your c you're going to put um Second string, first fret, fourth string, second fret, and fifth string, third fret. And I use my thumb to block the sixth string because you're not going to use that. Okay. G, um, the way I play it is first string, third fret, fifth string, second fret, and sixth string, third fret. A minor, second string, first fret, third string, second fret and fourth string second fret i also use my thumb to block that one for the f if you know how to play a bar chord you can do the bar chord f but you don't have to um you can just play like this so the way i do it is just second fret or sorry second string first fret third string second fret fourth string third fret and fifth string third fret I use my thumb to block this one because if you can't play it, you can use it to like press hold down the the um, first fret on that string. But if you can't do that, just use it to block it, and then use your bottom finger to block the first string as well because you don't want to use that. If you can't bar like that, you can just go like this. Only the the middle strings, the second, third, fourth, and fifth strings are being played. So I'm gonna, this is how you play it, this is how it's going to sound, and then I'm going to teach you guys kind of like chord progression you can use, I guess. So the string pattern I use is down, up, up, 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 down. That's pretty much it. You're doing for um you're doing you're repeating that pattern four times for each chord so that'd be that's eight beats per chord Okay, um, you can do that strumming pattern for the entire song if you really want to, or you can do some picking pattern if you want. This is what it sounds like with the picking pattern. I'm doing fifth string twice and then first string then second string or like the bass note basically so the bass note of C is um, the fifth string so that's five five And then for the G, I actually play the G without the, without the first.
first string. You can play like that, just the fifth and then the sixth like that. And then we do the same thing, but instead of the fifth string, we do the sixth string, because that's the bass note. Then the A minor. Then the F. You can do, um, just, you can just play the high E open. It still sounds good. switch between the chord progressions if you want. Ooh, the sun. You can switch between the chord progressions if you want or like the style. You can play strumming like the strumming for part of the song. You can either play strumming for the entire thing, picking for the entire thing, or you can just mix them together. That would sound pretty cool too. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Super easy tutorial. I think this is a good song to learn if you're a beginner. Um, anyone can play it. It's really, it's really good. It's a really good song too. If you've never heard the song, Listen to it and learn it from like from this, um, because it's really good. It's a beautiful song, um, one of my favorites for sure. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, make sure you read the description. I leave a lot of stuff. I leave some stuff on there that I think you guys should know, or if you want to know, I'll leave like the chords, the link to the chords or whatever. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoy. Make sure you drop a like, subscribe. Also, I'm gonna be posting more. I'm gonna try to post more. Maybe over the summer the more because um, jeez. Yeah, I have a lot of stuff to do for school, but I'll try to post more. I keep saying that, I know, but I'll try my best. Over the summer, I think I'll for sure post more. Yeah, if you enjoy, drop a like, subscribe.